Hi friends, my name is Heather. Thanks for clicking on my video today. Today I'm going to be doing a collaboration video with my sweet friend Mrs. Gigi. This is called Hashtag Create with MH. And each week we take a quote and a theme and we do something creative. And this week the quote is, Never ever underestimate the importance of having fun. And the theme is happy or happiness. So that's so true. Never underestimate the importance of having fun. It's so important for us to have fun. You know, when we're doing our arts and crafts and everything, um, we don't want it to feel like something that we have to do or, you know, a job or something. We want to have fun doing it. So I thought I would make a little mini master board today just for fun. Um, last night I did my little video for hashtag Thursday Crafty Friends and I made a rainbow coaster, but when I was done, I had paint left over and I made this little coaster here just having fun. You know, that's, that's awesome. And then like I had this master board already glued together and this morning I just added some paint and some stamps because it was fun to do. So don't forget to have fun when you're doing your arts and crafts. So I'm going to use this index card. It's kind of like one of the bigger ones. Don't know the size. And I'm going to glue paper on it, which I don't like to tear it that way because I don't want to see the white. So I'm just going to start gluing these papers down. Should have probably grabbed another glue stick because this kind doesn't really work that good, but that's okay. I can always grab it if I need to. We'll glue that down there. I just grabbed some of these papers from my scrap, so it's always fun to use scraps up. And then if there's any hanging off, I will, of course, cut it off at the end. I already have this part off, so I might as well just glue it down here somewhere. Take. I try to rip it where you don't see the white. Okay, I'll glue this one down here on the corner. Because it's already got the straight sides there. We'll glue this one on the corner over here. I thought instead of doing like a big, please excuse my desk, it is made of metal and it like pops if you push down on it. So I um, thought instead of doing like a whole big full size master board, I could just do a little mini one and then that way I don't take up so much of your time. So I know we all have busy lives and other people, other friends to watch. So I'm going to try to make this um, without taking up too much time here. Here's a piece ripped, so we'll glue that one down. Just randomly sticking them on here. Let's see, let's use some of this here. Hope you all are having a great day so far. It's Friday. So hopefully you all have some something fun to do this weekend. We're supposed to be getting snow again not my favorite thing. <laughs> That's all right though. Uh, we're going to stick this somewhere. We'll just put it here. <sighs> okay. That's getting annoying. The desk thing. Sorry. Okay. I do have like some little 
book pages and a little bit of piece of song music paper that's what you call it here too that I might mix in here I ripped some of it up already so we'll stick mix that in with it here we go making master boards is fun right then of course you can cut it down like even though I could probably get at least two ATCs out of this if I wanted to don't know if I'm gonna do that but these little mini ones are always fun you can just um, you can send them out in happy mail or something if you wanted to you can write on the back of it we haven't used any of this paper yet, so let's rip some of that off. Need to rip it this direction. All right, so we'll put some of this on there. Ooh, what's on the back? Okay. So sorry, guys. I had to switch desk because this one, the other one, my camera setup would not attach to it. So now I have to use this one. But you can see, um, I, if you watch my videos, I actually bought some contact paper and covered the top of this desk. I like it. It's black and white, and it was a dollar from Dollar Tree. So good deal and when it gets all yucky looking or whatever I can just take it off and put some more down sorry for the shadows <clears throat> but um I went shopping and I got some stuff from Goodwill and I went to Dollar Tree and I went to Michael's and it was a big shopping day which we like never do <laughs> but um we did do that on Tuesday and I am gonna try to make a haul video and show some of the fun things that I found at the three stores so I'm gonna try to do that soon I don't know if I want to add any of that in there or not. I don't think we have any plans this coming weekend yet. Well, if it's real snowy, then we probably won't be doing anything. I don't really like to drive in the snow. Unless I have to. Put some of that up here. There was only there were only two choices of contact paper at Dollar Tree when I went and it was this or like some kind of beige that was really boring. And I thought this was pretty, black and white. I'm just gonna keep on gluing here I might go ahead and pause the video and finish this and then you don't have to keep watching the boring gluing stuff so I'm gonna finish I'm gonna pause and finish this and I'll be right back okay I'm back 
So my master board is done on this little index card. Well, it's one of the bigger ones. It's all covered up. I'll try to show you up close. Wait, kind of did it that way. It's got some gold and music paper, book page, and then a bunch of little scraps. So it's a little mini one. So I thought I would go ahead and add some other stuff on here, like maybe a little bit of paint with a stencil and maybe some stamping. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of paint here on this packaging I got from Amazon when I ordered something. I like to use this stuff for messy things. It comes in handy. And then you can see I use this stencil a lot. It's uh, pretty weird looking with all this color on it and I don't wash it off good every time, but <laughs> that's okay. So I like this one because it's got little mini dots and little, little things for, you know, many, like, smaller things, so I need to get some more stencils that has little tiny dots and things. I don't want to use a big one and cover up the whole entire thing. And just so you know, I don't paint things like normal people. I'm probably going to use the same sponge for all the colors. And I'm just going to let me make sure I'm staying in frame here. Just gonna sponge some pink on here with this stin this uh, stencil and this little sponge. Okay, maybe a little here. All right, so we've got some pink and then I'm just gonna kinda do that. And we're gonna add some blue. We'll add some bigger blue marks here. driving me nuts. And we'll use that. So we've got some pink and blue. And then I'm just going to kind of do that. You can see how professional I am. <laughs> Alright, let's add some gold to it. I'm going to get a little bit more gold here. Okay, so now we have our little master board here and it's got some paint on it. And I'm gonna let this dry for a minute and I got paint everywhere. And then I'll probably put, maybe do a little bit of stamping on top of it. My friends, uh, Sylvia D. and Amanda from Cooking Up Crafts. They're always doing beautiful mixed media with papers and paints and stamps. And I've been watching their videos, so they have given me inspiration. So hi, Amanda and Sylvia, if you're watching. And I will, I need to get my little cord over here. 
I will link their channels down below. Hang on. I gotta get my cord. Sorry. I didn't have my cord um, over here so that I could plug in my little heat tool here, but I am going to dry this for a second, so hopefully it's not too loud. And of course, I will link Mrs. Gigi's channel down below. That is who I'm doing this collaboration with. She's also very talented and makes such cute things. Sylvia and Amanda, they both make beautiful things too, all of them. So I will link them all down below. Please be go, be go. <laughs> Please be sure to go watch Mrs. Gigi and see what she has done with this quote and theme this week. My husband got me this new heat tool the other day. Very sweet of him. Mine quit on me. Hopefully you can hear me talking over this. Should have paused for this part because this is pretty boring, I'm sure, watching me dry my thing here. It's not all the way dry, but it should be good enough. All right. Hopefully you can hear me, could hear me over all that. All right. I've got some ink here and I've got this stamp that says my friend, my friend, my friend over and over. Let me see. There we go. I thought I would stamp this on there. This might be in might end up going into uh, a happy mail for somebody. I'm just going to add this up or on here, different spots. Yeah, that's cute. Alright, so we added some of that and I also have this heart over here I thought I would maybe use. I'm gonna wipe the edges. Sorry about that. You can't really tell it's a heart, but that's okay. Add some. There we go. All right, so I think I'm gonna call that done. It's cute. Here is my little master board and I had fun making it. And like the quote says, never ever underestimate the importance of having fun. And this was fun and made me happy. I used happy colors and had fun doing it. So thank you, Mrs. Gigi, for uh, doing this collaboration with me. We do this every Friday. And then um, on Thursdays, Mrs. Gigi and Sylvia D and I, we do hashtag Thursday Crafty Friends. And we have a good old time crafting. So please check out everyone's channels, especially watch Mrs. Gigi's uh, video for this week. And I'll see you all again again soon. Have a great weekend. Bye.